Karen. Um, you just had a wonderful round on Patch this weekend. So tell me a little bit about your rides today and how they went for you. Well, it's been uh, it's been an up and down day. <laughs> I think I've experienced every emotion that you could experience today. Um, but so Reg, I had um, he started out great, and then he just you know it was a long shot to get him here. I'm so thrilled we got him here. I'm thrilled that I tried, and he's you know he's just told me that it's just not you know it's not going to happen. And I didn't think he did. You know he wasn't. He did. He gave me everything he had. So, um, so I'm not unhappy. It's just, it is, it is what it is. Sure. And then Patch, I almost didn't take him because I thought he was so freaked out by all the people. <laughs> and the, he's been so freaked out by all the people here. And I was like, I just don't want to give him a bad experience. And then I was like, well, you are never going to get this amount of people anywhere. So at some point he's going to have to experience this. And he does love the cross country and he's such a good jumper. So I was like, well, we'll, um, we'll give it a whirl. And he was amazing. He was amazing except when he tried to run me back to the barn. Because <laughs> there were no people at this one section. <laughs> so, um, but he was, he was, he was on it. He did every, all of the hard stuff so easily. Like he doesn't even doesn't even actually try very hard. <laughs> so so that's, good. that's what you want. I'm thrilled with him. I think he will have so upped his game from having experience this weekend. Um, you know, it's his first four star. You know, and I'm just I'm thrilled. Slightly afraid to go back in the Coliseum tomorrow, but <laughs> but also thrilled that he gets that experience again. So, so you think the atmosphere for him today wasn't nearly as big of a deal as it was yesterday? Do you think? No, I think it has been. He's been, you know, he has been a little, you know, um, uh, it's just been overwhelmed. But I think when you have cross country jumps in front of you, when you have a good cross country horse, they really, you know, if, as long as there was something in front of them to do, it really keeps their focus and. Um, that's what he, you know, he told me today. He's like, I, I got this, right? In terms of, you know, he knows to look for flags and he just, he goes in between them. And that's a really, that's a really fun feeling. He's got an amazing gallop. Um, I was fairly quick on him. Not even, I didn't even look at my watch because I wasn't planning on, you know, I just wanted to give him a good experience. Um, and he finished well and fit. And so I'm thrilled. So how did the course ride um, versus how you walked it? Did it ride pretty true to what you thought it was going to do? I thought it rode uh, pretty much exactly like it walked. Um, so, you know, which was there were there were different options. It depend on how your horse dealt with the torrent, really, right? Is you know for how they dealt with the knolls that the jumps were on, etc. It was more the terrain than anything else that dictated how they were going to jump the combination striding wise and whatnot, and that. Um, you know, that's a very good cross country course, I think. I think Derek did an amazing job. I think it was um, it was a true test, um, but not, um, but, but good for the horses. Sure. You know, they really could read everything well, and that I think is so important. And what was your favorite part of, what was your favorite question today? Oh, geez. I, I actually don't know. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> they were all like, you felt like, felt like you did something by the end of the day yeah. you know it wasn't like uh, you know you, you definitely felt like your horse accomplished something right there were you know that it, it wasn't a walk in the park that's for sure um, but it was also when it it rode really well and it then it went and went really well so I think that's a great cross-country design sure and I know the atmosphere tomorrow is going to be interesting for Patch, but, yes. you know, aside from that, what's your strategy for him? I really, like now, is, is just want him to, I want him to experience, uh, have the experience, because it really, it's such an important part of an event horse's career, is the development, right? And I think you don't get this amount of people anywhere, right? Anywhere. I was watching one of Williams, or listening to one of Williams' interviews, and he said, you just don't get these people except at the Olympics. So I'm just thrilled that my horse has a chance to experience this um, and he will come out better for it having experienced it now. Absolutely. Well, thank you so much for your time, Sharon. We really appreciate it. You're and best so of welcome. luck to you this weekend. Thank you so much. Thank you.